Okay, today I'm showing you an 81 Chevrolet Scottsdale C10. And you're probably looking at this thing, what a rust bucket. And frankly, it looks that way. It is a rust bucket, really. But it's something more than that. It's a sleeper pickup. This pickup is just amazing. Yeah, it has rust, but got some oil in the back, so the back of the rust, that's not where it's there for, but this pickup is like an amazing pickup. It's very bare minimum. What that means is there is like, hold on, that there is no air conditioning. I mean, I guess you got five when air conditioning. No power or anything. No carpet. Got Taz on there. Manual four speed shifters upside down, which is cool. Four wheel drive, that radio doesn't work. Original radio, I'll just pop the lid real quick for the, for the hood. Hood. There we go. Hood should be popped. No, it's not. And the other door. Try to show you. Hold on. I did not want him to pop. It, it says it's pop, but it's not. I'm pulling the deal, but oh, it's got these vents. Those are nice. It's got a little tow deal, old school tow deal that is. Got that many miles on it. it says it goes 85, but it goes faster than that. We proved that. It's got half a tank. That's good. Horn doesn't work. It's good. It's always neat. Nice to have a un non-working horn, right? See, it's a little in rougher shape, but the whole pickup is really. Let's try to get this hood. I just want to pop. No, it's. Oh, there we go. Had to push down on it. On the. Now you're probably thinking, looks like an old 350. Well, it's actually only three years old. I helped my dad build it. If I can find it here. Oh, where is it? Ah, oh, that's not it. Right there. It's actually kind of warm. But you can see, I don't know if you can see that real well. But that's my name, my brother Matthew's, and my dad's name. And it's got some headers. I'm not going to touch it because this engine's still warm. It's got some, I think, flow hard exhaust or heartbeat exhaust or something like headers and exhaust. And got a Edelbrock intake and carburetor. And that's about all. It's just a little beefed up. Not too bad. Edo Brock uh, air filter thing. Kind of looks like it needs a little cleaning. But overall, this pickup is a very good pickup. Brakes work good. They lock up in the winter once in a while, but that's because it gets cold and this thing's cold blooded. But this thing is a very solid pickup. Now, doesn't look that way, but it's very soft. I would start it, but it's my dad's and I don't want to get in trouble for starting it. So, but someday I hope this beauty's mine. Oh, shut. Alright. It's got aftermarket rims too that are exactly aftermarket rims that are very nice when they're shined up, but right now they don't look like much. Shut this hood. Yeah, last peek at the engine. Chevrolet orange, of course. Gotta have it Chevrolet orange. 
And of course, it doesn't have a foot ornament because, like I said, it's bare minimal. Other than that, this pickup is solid. Place this one. I hope that doesn't happen. But if it does, what can I do about it, I guess? But yeah, I hope one day this pickup becomes mine. But it's a sleeper pickup, is what it is. It's got rust, like here. It's got a little rust. You can kind of wiggle, but it's pretty good. You know, fender moves. But eh, it's just cosmetic stuff. This pickup is very solid. But I like that. You like that sticker. Ruger. Pheasants. Hate the pheasants. See, it's got Edelbrock stickers. Yes, they're white, but that's because it's been on there so long. They faded. And it's got brackets for the whippers, but he took them off so he could fit it in the garage over there. But there's not room in the garage for them anymore. But they look pretty sweet with fiberglass things. And these mirrors are actually supposed to be white. But one of them broke, so my dad just got chrome ones for him. I mean, he is supposed to, he's a very bare minimum pickup. Like I said, there's no air conditioning, no carpet, no hood ornament. That's not a very big deal. Four-speed manual transmission with four-wheel drive. I always forget that. And dual 15-gallon tanks, I think they are. Yeah, one the. Right driver side doesn't work, but other than that, this pickup very solid. I'll I suppose I'll see you guys.